Well, hello everyone. This is John, and today we are doing stories from Disney Animals Storybook Collection. Today we're doing one from the Aristocats, The Surprise Party. Early one morning, Thomas O'Malley yawned, stretched, and found three little kittens jumping on his bed. Marie, Berlois, and Toulouse began to sing cheerily while Duchess presented O'Malley with a dish of cream. Happy birthday, the cat sang out. Happy birthday to you, dear Abraham de Lesse, Giuseppe, Casey Thomas O'Malley. Now children, Duchess began, who wants to give Thomas his birthday present first? I do, I do. Toulouse replied, follow me, Mr. O'Malley. Yeah, said Boulois, follow him. As soon as O'Malley back was turned, Duchess whispered to Boulois and Marie, come children, let's get on with our plans for Thomas's surprise party. Toulouse led O'Malley into the sunroom. This is where I do my greatest work, Toulouse announced and today I'm gonna paint your portrait. Face this way, please, and don't move. Squish, splurt, splat. Toulouse began squirting paint from various tubes. O'Malley was busy watching Toulouse, that he didn't see what was happening behind him. A little while later, Toulouse finished his painting and presented it proudly to O'Malley. That's real swell, Toulouse, O'Malley said. I don't suppose you could teach me how to do that. Sure, Toulouse replied. I can teach you. He smothered a smile. The birthday surprise plans were right on track. Toulouse showed O'Malley how to mix paints to get different colors. Then they outlined a picture. Finally, they painted and painted and painted. I never had such birthday fun in my life. O'Malley said when they were finished. I can't wait to show this to Scat Cat and the band when we jam. Just then, Marie and Berlois walked into the room. Our turn, our turn, Marie said to O'Malley, climbing to her spot atop the piano. Would you like to hear some scales and arpeggios? We planned a special birthday song just for you, Berlois said. Want to hear it? Well, sure I do, O'Malley said. Berlois cracked his toes while Marie moved to the other side of the piano and sat up straight. She made sure O'Malley was looking at her, not outside, where the others were setting up his surprise party. Okay, Berlois said at last. Are you ready? Ready, O'Malley replied. Berlois stretched along the keyboard and played their new song while Marie sang. O'Malley was loving the tempo and couldn't believe they had written him his very own tune. You can join us if you want to, Mr. O'Malley, Marie urged. Soon O'Malley was singing along. Thank you for the best song I've ever heard. As early evening approached, Duchess intercepted O'Malley. Do you want to go for a birthday stroll, she asked. Well, sure, O'Malley said. That old band can wait. There's nothing I'd rather do than go on a birthday walk or stroll with you. When they reached the end of the garden, Duchess pulled a wrapped gift from behind the rose bush. Happy birthday, dear Thomas, she said, presenting it to him. A bow tie. Thanks, Duchess, he said. Between you and those kittens, this has been a terrific birthday. It's not over yet, you know, Duchess told him. We do have one last surprise for you. Duchess led O'Malley into the dining room. I hope everything is to your liking, Madame said to O'Malley. Toulouse, Berlois, and Marie were there with Roquefort, too. Happy birthday, they all called out. They had prepared all his favorite foods. O'Malley and Duchess even shared a salmon souffle. Say, what a terrific birthday, O'Malley said. I do think it's almost time for bed though, little ones. Before we go to bed, 
Can we go look at the stars, Marie asked. Oh, yes, Duchess agreed. As they all headed outside, that's a wonderful idea. And Thomas, I have to, conf I have to confess the dinner was your second to last birthday surprise. Surprise, yelled Duchess and the kittens. Surprise, hollered Scat Cat and the band. Wow, O'Malley exclaimed. Turning to Duchess and the kittens, he asked, how did you pull this off? You were with me all day. Marie giggled. Well, sometimes some of us were with you, while others of us were preparing, Duchess concluded. When the night finally ended, O'Malley, O'Malley turned to Duchess and the kittens. Thanks for the best birthday I ever had. It's over now, right? He said, laughing. Yes, Toulouse whispered sleepily. Happy birthday to you, Abraham de Lesse, Giuseppe, Casey, Thomas, O'Malley. The end. Thanks for listening. I mispronounced a lot of words that I uh, researched and still managed to mess them up. But uh, if you're interested in learning a little bit of uh, some of the language of the Aristocats, it's quite interesting learning different types of cultural languages and how to pronounce words. So uh, don't judge me too harshly, but um, thanks for listening. See you next time.